Ban on two channel scopes. Who's for that? Ban on two channel scopes. It's just it's it's not optimum. That's like an environmental issue right there. You've gone to the like you know because uh, if you need four channels, you've got to have buy and have a second oscilloscope. That is environmental waste. That's not going to meet environmental you know zero targets or whatever. What is it? Net zero. Net zero goals. Two channel oscilloscopes are not going to meet net zero goals by 2030 or whatever. 20, is it 2030 or 2040 for the net zero bullshit? Yeah, ban two channel scopes. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I, uh, from an environmental point of view, the, the TMA is going to have to get on this. In fact, we could ask ChatGPT. Let's ask. Who wants to ask ChatGPT whether or not... <laughs> Let me see if I can get this working. Hang on. Okay, let's ask ChatGPT, shall we? Let's let's use the latest version four. Don't want any of that three point five rubbish. Okay, now how are we going to word this? Imagine you are an oscilloscope company. Write a press release on why you are banning two-channel oscilloscopes. Reasons can include net zero environmental goals because two channel i'm i'm sort of like really telling it oh sorry you can't see what i'm typing banning channel zeros and will only sell four channel scopes from now oh i wonder if it gets scopes wonder if it knows what scopes are reasons can include net zero environmental goals because two channel oscilloscopes are environmentally damaging because people need two scopes instead of one. I'm giving a lot of crap. This is not good. This is poor. Okay, but let's go. For immediate release, Innovative Oscilloscope Corp <laughs> announces the discontinuation of two-channel oscilloscopes in favor of four-channel models. In Innovative, April 1st, Innovative Oscilloscope Corp, a global leader in oscilloscope technology, announces today that it will cease production and sales of its two-channel oscilloscopes to focus exclusively on four-channel models. This decision is driven by our commitment to provide cutting-edge solutions for our customers and aligning with our net-zero environmental goals. Discontinuation of two-channel oscilloscopes is part of a larger, our largest strategy to reduce our environmental impact, increase efficiency for our customers, and provide better value in the long run. Our research, this is great, our research has shown that four-channel oscilloscopes offer several advantages over their two-channel counterparts. Efficiency! A single four-channel oscilloscope can perform the same task as two two-channel models, reducing the number of units needed, cutting down on manufacturing and shipping-related emissions, and decreasing resource consumption. Usability. With four-channel oscilloscopes, users can observe and analyze multiple signals simultaneously, streamlining their work, and making it easier to, to troubleshoot complex circuits. The added functionality and versatility will help professionals cross industries to accomplish their tasks more efficiently. Reduced e-waste. By focusing on four-channel oscilloscopes, we aim to decrease the number of devices that become obsolete or discarded, as they offer more functionality and longer lifespans. This move aligns with our commitment to minimize electronic waste and promote sustainable practices in the industry. Cost effectiveness. Our four-channel oscilloscopes provide a better long-term investment for our customers, as they can consolidate multiple devices into a single unit, uh, this reduces the need for additional purchases, leading to long-term cost savings. Wow! It keeps going! Innovative Oscilloscope Corp. recognizes that this decision may impact some of our customers who rely on two-channel models, and we are committed to providing a smooth transition to four-channel oscilloscopes. We are offering special trading programs and discounts for customers looking to upgrade their current two-channel devices. As a company, we remain dedicated to innovation and sustainability. By discontinuing our two-channel oscilloscopes, we hope to pave the way for a more environmentally friendly and efficient future in the test and measurement industry. <laughs> <laughs> innovative oscilloscope.com oh no one can see the text can't you yeah how's that for immediate release <laughs> how's that how's that that is great did it create an actual web page um it can but i think it, it can only create like basic html pages i mean seriously though like how good is that right i mean that's just absolutely incredible Right, I, I, I just gave it like waffle, mentioned a few things, right? And then it just produced all of that. It's, it's just like, and it's absolutely nailed it, right? 
Like, you could maybe add a couple of things, but it's absolute, like, you know, it's got four major points there, right? And it's like, and it even, you know, mentioned like a trading programs and like it mentioned, you know, I didn't mention anything about, you know, people being concerned about it, but it's, it's picked up on that, that people might be concerned about it. We're offering a trading program and discounts for customers looking to upgrade their two channel, right? Recognize may impact some of our customers rely on two channel models and we're committed to providing a smooth transition, right? It's got all the correct, all the correct words in there, right? It's, it's phrased. Like, you know, corporate speak, it absolutely specializes in corporate speak. It's absolutely nailed that, right? And I, I thought that was a very poor prompt from me. That was poor prompt engineering on my part, but the words were there. It, it understood what I wanted to do. And I, I basically, well, I, I had to, it'd be interesting to see what had happened if I didn't prompt it with the net zero environmental goals, if it could come up with why are you abandoning two channel oscilloscopes? Um, I, w I would have to start a completely new chat for that. Actually, I'll, I'll do that right now, right? GPT-4 again. If, if you haven't seen the different models, right? GPT-3.5, and like its, its conciseness is only rated two out of five. Don't know what that means. Reasoning three, speed is five, but the legacy ones like that. Um, GPT-4 is conciseness is four. It's slower though, GPT-4 is slower. Um, as opposed to five, but I don't find it slower. Anyway, let's 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 do that, right? I've given it no. It shouldn't remember my previous one, I don't think, because it's not the same conversation. Imagine you're an oscilloscope company. Uh, write a press release on why you're abandoning two-channel oscilloscopes and why only sell four-channel scopes from now on. Let's see if it can nail it. It's going to have a go in a bold move to transform the oscilloscope market. A global leader in oscilloscope technologies today announces that they'll no longer be producing or selling two-channel scopes and focus exclusively on four-channel scopes, more efficient and versatile testing and as a as careful analysis market trends customer needs. Yeah, it hasn't. Yeah, it hasn't. Now, today's legend, more hands can give it a quote. <laughs> That's great. That's great. And the need, yeah, it, it hasn't picked up on the environmental aspect of it. Oh no, let's let's have a look. Enhanced functionality, right? Improved signal analysis. Wow. Wow. Ad adaptability to future needs. Wow. This is great. Better value by offering high quality. Yeah, it's not going to pick up on the I doubt it probably won't do another one. Yeah. To ease the transition, we'll provide support and resources. Once again, it's it's caring about people. Right, it's thinking about. It knows that people might be miffed about the decision. I banned two channel scopes, and yeah, wow. See, that is great. Even even from that short thing, right? That short. Just give me a reason why you're banning two channel oscilloscopes. So it knows all about oscilloscopes. It knows about the difference. You know, enhance the uh, ability to observe and analyze multiple signals simultaneously. Right troubleshooting and testing, easily compare and co correlate signals, right? So it knows about signal correlation between channels and stuff and better behave circuit behavior and faster identification, adaptability, continue to evolve, become more complex, you know, focusing on four channels. Yep. Wow. That is, how great is that? How great is that? That is fantastic. I mean, you've, you've got to be impressed, right? You've got to be impressed.